Snapchat, so I had this awesome thought last night where each of us should just be assigned a star. Like at the moment stars have these weird names like KIC296764 and it's not personal. So in our Milky Way galaxy alone there's something like 200 to 400 billion stars and there's something like 100 billion galaxies. So there's more than enough stars to go around for every individual to have their own star. I think there's like 7 billion humans alive now and 100 billion humans that have ever lived. So wouldn't it be cool if we were all assigned a star at birth and it was actually assigned on our birth certificate. So it's like you own this star in the galaxy. First thought this sounds like a very kind of gimmicky, fun, cute thing to do, but if everyone on the planet was assigned a star at birth, um, you would have kind of some motivation to know your place in the universe. Like if you were assigned a star at birth and the star was named after you, um, you would go and look that up. If you knew the exact coordinates, you know, the where it is in the galaxy, where it is in the universe, you'd want to look it up and learn about that. It's often said that the uh, Apollo missions the, and the moon landing sparked a massive resurgence in like STEM and kids getting into engineering and maths and science. This could do the same thing on a global level. And yet it's a tiny little simple change, but it would spark a curiosity in every single child on the entire planet. Every, the entire human species would have this resurgence in wanting to know its place in the universe. You'd also want to like learn about the stars. So you want to know, you know what composition it is, what type of star it is. And so you start learning about all the different types of stars, neutron stars, dwarf stars, all these things. That would just be like really freaking awesome to have um, a star and its location in the universe and its composition and makeup on your birth certificate alongside the, the town in which you were born. But that said, I want a star assigned to me now. Like, how do we go about that now? Um, I was thinking possibly one way is to do it through, again, blockchain, I always bring that up, but like a DAO blockchain where it assigns you a star and registers. So I just did a quick look up and it seems like the International Astronomical Union is kind of like the official but unofficial body for registering star names, but it seems like there's nothing official for registering anywhere. So if you can look at like proof of individuality, which is a big issue on the, on the blockchain, you know, like basically one, per one person gets one star, so you can't claim multiple stars, then you could create an awesome interface for finding the star you want. So imagine if it was an awesome like VR experience for picking your star, so you get to like zoom through all the known stars we, we have in the universe, and you kind of get to see them and understand them and learn about them and pick the star you want. Which would make it like an awesome visual experience, like a really fun experience trying to pick the star you want. Um, and then once you pick it, it gets registered on a blockchain, so it's permanent, etched into stone in the blockchain. So what do you reckon? That'd be really awesome, yeah? Like assigning stars to people, if people get really interested and passionate about deep space exploration and our place in the universe, how can we make this happen now? Snappy thoughts, at Future. See ya.